All right, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Urutia here, and I'm going to go over Unit 1, Lesson 7, Practice Problem Number 2. A blueprint for a building includes a rectangular room that measures 3 inches long and 5 and a half inches wide. The scale for the blueprint says that 1 inch on the blueprint is equivalent to 10 feet in the actual building. What are the dimensions of this rectangular room in the actual building? So we have two things going on here, right? We have the scale drawing and the actual bedroom. In this problem, the blueprint is the scale drawing of the actual bedroom. That's this part right here. So three inches long, five and a half inches wide. And we have a scale that is 10 feet is equal to one inch. So we're going to use the scale to calculate the actual bedroom. This right here is a representation of the actual bedroom with measurements. Because one inch is equal to 10 feet, if I want to find the number of feet in the actual bedroom, I'm going to multiply by 10. So now for each one here, this side of the room is three inches. To find the actual measurement in real life, it's going to be 30 feet. I do times 10 and then change the units to feet. For the width, we have five and a half inches times 10, which is 55 feet. Okay, so just remember when you're doing these problems is there's two things happening, the scale drawing and then the actual room. And remember which measurements go with which one. And this one's easy because inches, you know that's a drawing. Feet, you can't really draw 30 feet on a piece of paper. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen.